Tad says the best thing that we can do is to get celebrities involved. And what bigger celebrity than you? Are you suggesting that I go to Africa with, with you? And a whole bunch of other volunteers. Listen, I overheard your producer saying that you were behind schedule. Why not shoot this trip? You know, you'd get a whole week's worth of shows out of it, and you'd be giving this cause the attention that it deserves. Erica, I, I did not realize until I read this material just how many children are hungry and, and dying over there. Oh, my God, yeah. I know. That's what I thought when I read that, too. So, are you interested? I just might be. Well? Well, the, the, the number that's been calling David comes from a payphone in a bar that's up there, so... Amanda and Jake have checked into a hotel room nearby. What? They're just gonna sit up there? Mama, it's all they can do right now. Wait for that package to be delivered. I don't have the energy to take you on. I just used it all up. Great. So why don't you let me take you back to your room? That's all right. I got her. You don't have a clue as to what she needs, Junior. You know what, David? You need to back off. Or not. Come after little Adam, I dare you. You'll end up regretting it. I just might do that. You think that's gonna keep me away from Marissa? Because it won't. You see, I care about her. Maybe even falling in love. So you better get used to seeing us together. You okay? Depends. Did you mean that? The maybe falling in love part? Zack finally realizes that Kendall is guilty. He's not going to try to uh, pin the crime on you anymore. And with him deep in our debt, well, that will only tend to uh, assure us of that fact. So, from now on, we can concentrate on getting you a new trial date. We can get you exonerated. And you and I can be together like we've planned. I should have known you were being clever. <laughs> You're so good to me. Yes, yes. I need to make some phone calls. Okay. Be back soon. Okay. Thank God you're here. I need your help. Yeah, if you've got a problem, maybe you should be asking Adam. The problem help. is Adam. He's really starting to lose his mind. What are you doing? I told you to stay out of sight. I, I took all the necessary precautions. Oh. Don't worry, I, I closed all the blinds. Hope you're hungry. I just put a tenderloin under the boiler. What is this all about? Well, you've done so much for me, so I just... I wanted to do something nice for you. 